Okay, how's everyone doing? So, welcome back to the channel, and uh, I got something real special for you today. So, right in front of me, I have something that was given to me uh, just on loan from my good friend, Carlos Pascal. He's my uh, chef at work. Uh, he just recently got into wood building, and not just wood building, he has a real distinct love and a uh, real big heart for uh, things that are puzzle related and uh, I guess things of that sort. Uh, I'm not really a huge puzzle guy, though I do find myself kind of attracted to uh, things of like an easy nature. I really love things that are a little bit of a puzzle and I love in life figuring things out. So what I have in front of me is what he adoringly is calling strapped. It's based on like a cargo type imagery. It's made of reclaimed uh, basic hardwoods and I think it's, it's kind of genius because uh, to put something like this together is, uh, although not perfect, at the same time, very, very cool uh, in its execution. So what we have here is what he calls a level one puzzle. Um, what we have here on this one side is a uh, type of twist notch. So I guess on video, I'm just going to go ahead and uh, try to solve it. Uh, I'm not going to set a time because I have no idea what to expect. And uh, yeah, uh, I'm just loving the uh, the whole overall design. I'm loving the uh, <sighs> just the uh, insane quality of the distinct sleeve on the inside. Yeah, it's very cool, very very cool. Um, and again, I'm just gonna say that things like this are super important in the uh, puzzle making and. Uh, small wood crafts uh, field and market and community because just like cards things like this push people to uh, think way outside their uh, realm of comfort and uh, try something new and I, I totally can't I can't be more blown away by how cool something like this is although very simple um, as he says I uh, yeah, no, I, I can't really find any fault in it. I think it's really cool. He'll probably deck it out with a little bit more uh, adornments and uh, stamps and etc. in the future, but uh, I can't wait to get into this. So without further ado, this is Strapped by Carlos Pascal. Be sure to follow him on Instagram, uh, the link in the description below. And uh, let's get right into it. Um, right here, like I said, we have this like, um, turn pulley, it does turn, it turns all the way. Yeah, I'm just gonna try to just fiddle with things, um, <laughs> hopefully without breaking it. Cause again, this is like completely handmade, hand drilled, all that stuff. So I want to try to take uh, the best care of it that I can. So what I'm seeing, just in case he is one of those guys that like went ahead and did the extra mile thing. Just want to make sure okay. yeah I'm not gonna like spin it drop it nothing like that shake it I assume it's just a uh, simple twist yeah it's getting looser and looser right on so it does spin it spins all the way around um, let's try it the other way Okay, so try pulling it out. I see. That's fascinating. Okay, well, what you can see here is that, okay, so you don't twist it out. <laughs> That's actually very, very keen. This is actually really cool, dude. That's actually really cool. God damn. Okay, so here, let me see if I can get this into focus for you guys. So on it, he has a teeny tiny key. On the other side, it says key. <laughs> it's really cool. And then on the end of it, he has a teeny tiny little screwdriver. That's awesome, dude. So, um, I assume just because there's one screw, and if you look around this thing on the back, you have 
one screw right here. So logically, So, let's see here. I got that out of the way. Bam, bam. Let's see here. So, that seems like the easy thing to do. What else, what else? He also left me like a, there's a prize inside here. So I'm just trying to figure out, cause a lot of this is nailed in and glued. So I'm just trying to figure out if he like did some special, cause some of it doesn't look like attached, but I think that comes down to like, you know, how much of like the reclaimed wood was like completely even, et cetera, et cetera. So kind of hard to tell which part of this moves yet some oh oh some of this actually <laughs> oh that's interesting so it says oh and that's a there's a magnet on the other side that's that's really fucking genius wow look at that wow that's great. Let's see, and there's a little, your target is underneath. And see, like there's, it says push hard on the bottom of the, of the little drawer, right? And there's a little zodiac cross or a push hard. Oh, <laughs> wow. And then it says right here, give that a push. Oh, I see. And then you remove the cardboard. You push that. glued on so that's a cardboard piece so the seams seems to me that let's say uh, oh I'm doing this all wrong so it says push here but then I look <laughs> there's a keyhole marked because there's three holes and then there's one that's marked keyhole so I assume you take this bad boy and you shove it in here <laughs> wow and then you're supposed to push I just push the stuff out of the way and then that up front and then wham yeah the thing is smarties I think wow <laughs> that's that's actually quite genius because it has like a kicker kind of uh, ending dude bravo oh my god okay inside there's like a little bit of a magnet um, there's definitely a few oh, red herrings type looking things but other than that this is 
wicked. For a first time around, Carlos, you did an amazing job. Yeah, you, this is something to be definitely very, very proud of. Very well thought of um, concept. I think definitely, like, uh, for your first time around, you can definitely see uh, what you want, what you wanted and intended to do. Um, execution was fantastic. Yeah, woodworking is really, really great overall. Um, you definitely see where you need refinements, but uh, I'm gonna say out of 10, I'm, uh, from a, a level one standpoint, I'm gonna give this a solid seven. Um, Cause again, uh, the quality is there, given the amount of, given more time uh, on the next run, if you decide to do a design like this again, uh, I would definitely up, be up to seeing what he has in store. But yeah, uh, guys, if you really enjoyed this uh, as much as I did, I'm gonna go ahead and put this back together. Um, but if you really enjoyed uh, this video and videos like this, uh, please be sure to hit that like and subscribe button. It really helps me, helps the channel, and uh, gets me through my boring, monotonous days uh, in quarantine. That's insane. Um, but yeah, uh, like I said, be sure to like, subscribe, follow Carlos Pascal on uh, Instagram. You can find the link down again in the description box below. There we go. Wham. This guy over here. Wham. Nice and snug. This guy. And top it all off. This key goes back into the thing. Alright. Well, thanks very much, guys. I'll catch you guys in a bit. Ah! Wow.